We are in Microsoft Excel 2013. I'm going to show you how to merge cells. Now, if you'd like to have two cells merged together, you can easily highlight those two cells or more and then go up to the Merge and Center area, which is under the Home tab, and you hit the drop down. Now, if I click Merge Cells, what's going to happen is it's only going to keep the data in the upper left corner. So anything else that's here is it's just going to ignore and drop it. But let's just go ahead and show you that. So hit the drop down, merge cells, gives you the warning that that's about to happen. And so now we see the cells are merged. This is one big cell which covers two columns, but the data that was in the F, uh, F1 cell is now gone. So keep that in mind when you go to merge cells that you are going to lose data out of anything other than this top left. So let's go ahead and do it the same way. Let's go ahead and do it vertically. So I'm going to go ahead and highlight these two. Go back to Merge and Center, Merge Cells. Gives me the warning. And you can see it only kept the data in the top left. Although it put it towards the bottom, that's just because that's the way I have it positioned. But it still kept the data that was in the top. So that's Merging Cells in Excel 2013.